Nancy Pelosi's launch of a formal impeachment inquiry has an interesting Central Texas tie. In the late 1990s, of course, former President Bill Clinton was subject of an impeachment inquiry while in office. 25 News reached out to the man who helped to put together the investigation, the Star Report. That's Judge Ken Starr. And that report brought forth allegations of perjury and obstruction of justice in regard to then President Clinton back in 1998. Our Aaron Heff joins us now in the studio. What is his take on the announcement that we uh, heard yesterday from Congress. So Judge Starr has ample experience with impeachment proceedings, but he also gave his firsthand experience in an op-ed today. Judge Starr explained that the 230-year-old process of impeachment has been, on average, initiated no fewer than 62 times to no avail against a sitting president. In fact, of the eight successful impeachments, among the 62 initiated, not a single one was successful in the removal of an executive branch officer. Starr now makes a poignant observation observation writing today Pelosi confronts a fundamental question will the full house will the full house of representatives actually pursue formal impeachment as occurred with presidents Nixon and Clinton end quote coming to the conclusion that both aforementioned former presidents proceedings were ultimately not successful star saying quote for the first time in the Trump presidency the ultimate check of political accountability in our congressional order impeachment is seriously in play. Judge Starr went on to say Representative and Speaker Pelosi would do well to review our nation's rich history for guidance, citing her predecessor, Henry Clay. Now at six o'clock, we're going to be taking a closer look as to everything he said in regard to impeachment. So catch us there at six o'clock for more. All, All right. right. Very good. Aaron, thank, thank you, Aaron. You.